Hey guys, what's up? It's PJ here, and today we are going to do the sixth video in this series. And as you've noticed, as you've probably noticed, I have changed the font size to a lot bigger because I had somebody ask me to do that because um, the way I was recording, you couldn't really see what I was typing and without going full screen. So I'm sorry about that. I hope this is a lot better. Give me some feedback in the comments if um, if it isn't and I'll increase it even more. All right, so today we're going to finish we're going to finish the movement of the player. We're going to add jumping and falling, but we won't have any collisions, so we're going to be able to stop anything from happening. So, the first thing I want to do is I want to get rid of this set bounds and get rid of this um, serial version UID and get rid of the extends rectangle. We need to make um, these variables doubles so we can have a more precise movement rather than pixel by pixel. So private double um, x, y, and we'll have private int with height. So in here we'll do x equals game panel dot width divided by 2, y equals game panel dot height divided by 2, and this dot width equals width this dot height equals height. And then in here we need to just cast these um, x and y's to integers because the fill rect method takes in an integer rather than a double. Alright, so now we're going to add um, jumping and falling. So in here we'll do jumping, ah, if I can type it, equals false falling equals false. All right. So down in this key pressed um, method we're going to add one more and this will be uh, key event dot vk space for jumping and in and when you press space we're going to set jumping equal to true but we will not set it to false if you if you release the key we just want it to jump once you know. So um, in here if jumping and if falling so now we're gonna have we're gonna add a few variables. They're all gonna be doubles, and it'll be max or uh, um, um, jump speed, and that'll be five. And then private double current jump speed equals jump speed. And then two more doubles. Private double. Um, max fall speed equals 5 and private double current fall speed equals 0 0.1 so I'm just going to comment these jump speed fall speed um, this will be um, bounds and movement booleans. Alright, so in this jumping, what we're going to do is the jump speed is going to be really fast in the beginning and it's going to slow down because of gravity, which I'm not going to do like an accurate gravity calculation, but it'll look pretty regular, I guess. So in here what we'll do is y minus equals current jump speed. Now keep in mind, this won't be y later, it'll be an, a y offset variable and then um, current jump speed times e or no no minus equals 0.1 so it's gonna get slower by 0.1 pixel per second or per tick every tick and then what we'll do is if current jump speed is less than or equal to zero what we're going to do is we're going to do current jump speed is equal to jump speed and then we're going to do jumping equals false and for now falling equals true which will not always be the case but just to test this out so if we go in here and we go it'll go up and then we'll stop so you can see it kinda gradually it should gradually slow down um, it's a bit laggy, but on your computer it should be fine. Now in the falling, what we're going to do is y plus equals 
falling speed. And then, no, uh, current falling speed. Current fall speed, sorry. Um, and then, if the current fall speed, yeah, speed is still less than the max fall speed, is still less than max fall speed. What we're gonna do is we're gonna um, is we're just gonna add point one. So now if we do this, you jump up, and then you start falling, and it gets faster, and then it maxes out. Um, uh, let's see. So once we set, like, if it's not falling, yeah, um, we're just going to set um, current fall speed equal to point 0.1 so then later we can restart the fall without going so fast when you start um, so yeah that's really it for this video in the next video I think we will probably be adding um, blocks to the map like a tile I guess so yeah thank you guys very much for watching be sure to subscribe leave a comment if you like this new um, size of the font. And yeah, thank you very much. See you next time.